When looking at regression, you actually have to think of more than just one thing at a time. In the past, especially when you did statistics, you would do one variable, meaning you would look at somebody's height, and then you would take the average height of everybody in the room. Then you would look at the standard deviation, the mode, the median. However, with correlation, what you're looking at is the relationship between two different variables. So you need to not look only at a single variable, but how data relates to other data. This is in fact called correlation. In this course, we're going to be learning about the four different types of relationships. Now the first type of relationship looks something like this. You have x, which is your independent axis. Independent axis and y, which is your dependent. When you deal with this, you're going to have a scatter plot. Now the scatter plot means that you've got different types of relationships that fall in different categories, but generally they tend in one area. In this case, this is called a positive linear relationship. Now, if we have a positive linear relationship, you can guess what comes next. A negative linear relationship. So with positive and negative, these are the two main types that we'll be focusing on for the term, or for this, pro for this unit. However, there are two other types you need to be aware of, although we won't be doing a lot with computation on. The first type looks like this and has dots scattered about everywhere. This is very easy. This is no correlation. There is not a definite pattern, there is not a definite tendency, it's just out there. The other one that you'll have to look at can look different ways. First way that we'll look at is something like this, where it goes up and comes back down. Now if you notice, it tends to form something like a curve, whereas with positive, it tended to go up and negative tended to go down in a straight line. This forms a curve, so we call this a non-linear relationship. Anything with a curve can fall under this non-linear relationship. So when you go up, if you level off and it changes direction severely, this would also be a non-linear relationship. Anything where there is a change in the direction that is not constant is considered a nonlinear relationship. 